Raspail, Raspail in English, and I'm the director of this Museum of Contemporary Art in Lyon. This is the first French retrospective of uh, Yoko Ono. Uh, it means we show works from uh, 1952 to 2016. The idea uh, we share with Yoko is to uh, suggest to the visitors to share the works and to practice the works. In this exhibition, we decided to redo a part of original work. So, for instance, these very famous works where you have to climb scale to, to read something on the ceiling. Sometimes in a normal exhibition, you, you have the, uh, the ladder and you have an inscription and you say, okay, well, you have to climb, but it's strictly forbidden to uh, rent because it's uh, an original. I has to, to, to Yoko to redo these famous paintings from the 60s. She did that in uh, Chamber Street in New York City. And uh, these are the first instruction paintings. We just know these paintings with, uh, from photos, black and white photos, and she was all right to redo this thing. So it's very simple. These works are very famous, are very important. This idea is absolutely fantastic. I was very interested in the second part of the work of uh, Yoko no. Second part means after 80s, uh, because you know, because of John Lennon, she was a kind of uh, uh, cracks in, in her life. And uh, from that date, she's more and more interested in the question of women, the violence of a woman. She's more and more interested in the, the question of peace. But these works are not very well known. And one works very I think for me very characteristic and very fantastic is the freight train. She did that in 99 and it was first a uh, dramatic uh, situation. Uh, people from Mexico tried to, to, to pass through the, the custom to, to go to the state and we uh, finally uh, found them dead in, in freight train. So uh, she um, take this uh, idea to uh, reverse the, 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 the symbol and to, to show to people uh, a kind of optimistic vision of the world. And when we decided to show this work, she said, OK, it's fantastic, but please, uh, it's better you reconstruct the work. And if you do that, I give you the works. And, but I want for France, uh, freight train from 1944. The work is in connection with today's life, but with the memories. So it's just symbolic uh, attitude of Yoko Ono in the world today. She's uh, the woman who recreates the idea of performance. And today, uh, everywhere in the world, especially in Europe, but uh, everywhere in Europe, uh, in the world, sorry, uh, you have a lot of young artists uh, found of uh, the question of performances. And she was the first to do, at the same time, something she named concert, event, performances. She mixed the music and the visual arts. So today she, she is one of the um, artists who uh, opened the mind, opened the world. So I think. Um, she is more and more important uh, for different reasons. Um, half Japan, half American woman walking during the 60s uh, uh, on, the, on the stage with the stars. Uh, um, the image is not very clear, but I think, and, uh, and this retrospective is, uh, I think it's one of the steps to, 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 uh, for a new purpose. I think it, she is more and more important. Yoko Ono is not against. Uh, the reason why she has two worlds, yes, and imagine. So because in two worlds, you, you change the world, but you change the world with harmony. So I think it's, uh, I hope uh, this exhibition is symbolic of this kind of attitude. <laughs>